So in this video, I'm gonna show you how to prune your apple trees. It's early February, and I'm gonna go ahead and prune my apple trees before they come out of dormancy. This one on the right is a Fuji apple, and this is a delicious red. You can see that the Fuji has more of an upright growth, where the delicious red is more of a goblet style. Now I wanna show you the delicious red, how I prune it each year, and it's really looking good. I'm just gonna go ahead and clean up some things and make it ready for the spring. So there's some common things to look for when you're pruning, and here are the examples. First thing you wanna do is prune anything that is crossing and rubbing other branches. Next you want to get branches that are dead or diseased. Next you want to get interior branches that are going to be intersecting other branches and creating clutter inside the tree. Lastly I prune for shape and function that way the tree grows the way that I want it to grow. So one of the things when talking about shape is you want branches that come out like you see here. You also don't want branches that just come straight up. Unlike this branch here where it curves out away from the center of the tree, this branch comes off this node and makes a straight run right to the top. Lastly is the central leader. As you can see coming off the trunk, I have selected over the years this branch to be my central leader. And as we get up higher, it begins to split. So what I'm gonna do is figure out, out of this group, which one is gonna continue being my central leader. Also what I'll do is with these branches coming off the bottom of the trunk, I'll do that similar central leader idea and figure out where at the top am I gonna continue it to grow. So there it is guys, thanks for watching. Just keep in mind that you can always come back and trim more. So if next year you saw something that you missed, you can just go ahead and cut it back. Go ahead and check out my other printing videos and thanks for watching.